We've all had a space at home that was once a study area during university days, where you needed only the essentials, a desk, a laptop, and a bunch of school stuff. But now, those days are over, and this space deserves better. The thing is, this space is full of challenges. It's only 8 by 8 feet, it is north facing, so little to no daylight, it faces an alley, it has very little wall space and a high ceiling. Not the best features to start off with, but that is what makes the design process more interesting, I guess. So the first idea is to add some storage space on this wall and a desk right in front of it. But I know for a fact that this would make the space a bit tight. So the other idea is to go simple with only a desk and probably a round one to facilitate mobility around it. If I can find a desk that has front corners. I gathered some inspiration images and made a mood board to find that main idea that will drive the design for the space. I think we're going for a clean, uncluttered space with maybe some orange and black and blue accents. I don't know. I did find the perfect desk though, so I am excited for that. desk and the rock arrived and I couldn't wait to install them but I just realized that I haven't painted the walls yet so now I need to move them out of the way Choosing paint colors makes me really excited first, but then I get so impatient and I just want to choose one already. And I know that the lighting affects how the color looks, so because this room is very blue already, I think I'm going for a warmer tone and I just really hope that it turns out good. Believe it or not, painting is my craft. I used to work in a paint shop and they would literally send me out to paint entire rooms for residential clients. So I kind of know what I'm doing and it's actually quite fun, but it's the end of the day. So we'll have to leave the painting for tomorrow. I really hope I can get the painting done today because this makeover is taking way longer than it should. I mean, it's just a small room. Can we get it done already?
When painting, precision matters. If you don't do it very carefully, it will show. And although I'm not very patient with other stuff, for me, painting is different. It's like therapy. But of course, the best part is when you are finished. Okay, so you might have noticed that we have a closet here and I decided to just hide it for now because this home office is also a YouTube studio. So we need to pretend that there is no closet there, at least for now, because of course it looks ugly. So yes, the only way to do it is by covering it up with a rug. Don't judge me, but I've always wanted to have a rug or like a tapestry on the wall. So this is the time to do that. It has been weeks and the home office is still not finished. But the truth is that I ordered some stuff and I was just waiting for it to arrive. Go, don't be afraid. Not this time. No, keep, keep it running. Yeah. Is it good? It should be fine, oh yeah. 